in your fifth, first game after a bit of a losing streak, and they gave up 20 shots in that, 21 shots during that first period. So it didn't look like it was going to happen. The goalie came up big with uh, his performance tonight. It's not bad, eh? No. <laughs> The first period, we uh, <clears throat> we had some penalties that we had to kill. Our, our penalty kill has been really good as of late. And um, Andre Pavlik was pretty good in the first period, especially in the first, and a big save in the third. Um, we found a way to get the lead, uh, extend the lead, and uh, and we, we, we did a good job at protecting the lead. Um, so after the first period, I, I think, you know, and it, it, that's the funny part about hockey. I, I truly believe that we've played a better game the game before against mm -hmm. Chicago um, o overall. Uh, but tonight we won. So it's, um, you know, guys uh, showed uh, some maturity in their game, second and third period. Uh, so it's a big win for us. Is there something you have to say to the team about discipline, though, when, when they take four penalties in that first period, especially against a team like Chicago that has that type of offense? We talked about it. Um, we uh, we talk about it consistently. Um, sometimes it's the reactions, just uh, trying to be strong on the puck or on the stick, and then uh, just the motion of uh, hitting a stick, uh, like the Brian Straits penalty. Uh, wants to be strong on the puck, strong on the stick, and it's. Uh, but it, it, in the rules now, it is a penalty, so we have to change. It's the reactions that. You know, we have to make it a habit of, of playing the puck uh, differently. How do you feel about Andre's play lately, not just today, but heading into this game? How has he been playing? Um, he's, he's been good around the team. He's been good in uh, practices. He's been good at supporting Eric Comrie. Um, he, he, he bought into uh, giving his best uh, for the Moose, and he's... Uh, He's been really good. He's um, he's got experience. He feels comfortable, and he's been really good. It's not Cosmic, uh, Yeah. How do you feel about his game tonight? You know, when when Scott is moving his feet, um, he, he's a good player. He's um, like all players, obviously. But when you're moving your feet, and especially him, uh, when he gets his feet moving, when he's on the puck, when he's uh, when he's aware on the ice, um, I like his game. It's it's all about confidence. He's uh, he's playing with more confidence. I think there's a good chemistry between uh, him, uh, Cormier, and Olsen, and uh, it shows on the ice. I was talking about Ryan Olsen and the play since he's come back from Tulsa, what he's been able to do, especially with back-to-back -back games with a goal. What have you thought about his game overall? Um, again, a confidence uh, thing. Um, He's uh, he spent a lot of time in the past to uh, improve his game as a centerman. Uh, we can see that at times he's uh, he'll take face-offs, um, and he's pretty good at it. But I think he's got um, great potential to be a winger because of his speed, his size, uh, and his ability to uh, battle one-on-one -on -one and then to win those battles. So. And having, I think, Patrice in the middle is, is the older guy, he's the, the leader, he's the veteran, and he's, uh, he's pushing Kosmachuk and Olsen, and those guys are gaining confidence playing together. So I, I liked uh, Ryan Olsen's game tonight and uh, today, and, and, and for the last few games he's been pretty good, so I'm happy for him.